Hello and welcome to the next episode of the My Thoughts On series. In this episode, we're going to take an unloan AFC Bournemouth goalkeeper, Aaron Ramsdale, who's currently on loan at AFC Wimbledon. He joined Sheffield United in 2013 after graduating from their youth academy. Ramsdale appeared twice as an unused substitute during their 15 16 cent campaign against. Coventry and Scunthorpe. In May 2016, he signed his first professional contract with the club. On the 31st of January 2017, he was signed by Premier League outfit Bournemouth for a fee of 800,000. Ramsdale was loaned out to Chesterfield for the rest of the 17-18 season. On the 4th of January 2019, Ramsdale joined AFC Wimbledon on loan until the end of the 2018 to 2019 season. The next day, Ramsdale made his debut for the Dons in a 3-2 third round FA Cup victory over Fleetwood at the Highbury Stadium. His, le- his league debut came a week later in a 1-1 draw with Coventry City at the Rico Arena. One of his most notable goalkeeping performances came in their fourth round FA Cup victory against West Ham, where he made a couple of outstanding and very pivotal saves, the very important points in the game, to make them win 4-2 against West Ham. Sadly, they got knocked out on the fifth round of the FA Cup on the 16th of February against Millwall. As much as being involved in club football, Ramsdale has represented England at under-18, under-19, under-20 and under-21 level. Altogether in English league football, Ramsdale currently has made 33 appearances in his career. Why I think we should sign Aaron Ramsdale, and this will become more clear in my con- contracts video which is going to be coming out later on in the week. I know Lambert has said not for us to bring in loan players because obviously why bring in loans when you've only got people good enough um, and I think personally that uh, Dean Gherkin will be gone at the end of the season I've heard a lot of people saying that they would really want obviously want Bart to stay but also think it's very likely due to us being in League 1 that we will cash in on him from what I've read and heard I feel it's very likely that we will keep him and obviously he wants to retire here so I can see Gherkin leaving in the summer because his contract runs out and I think that um, Harry Wright still is a bit off, uh, off in terms of first team action. I can still see us being a third choice for at least another season and a half, maybe. I think, you know, he's on loan at Chelmsford at the moment. So I feel like having someone else in there, um, and that's something you do commonly see for a lot of the League One and League Two clubs throughout the last couple of years, is they rarely have more than one senior goalkeeper and generally tend to loan out the other one, loan in the other one. So in this case, Aaron Ramsdale, who has League One experience, and League 2 experience with Chesterfield. I think he'd be a good pick um, for us. I obviously can't see signing him permanently, but I think a lot of what he adds to his game is you know, he's commanding his box well, has great reflexes, and obviously quite fast in terms of he's quite athletic as well, and I think that works towards us. as a, as just my opinion, and I think that we should sign Aaron Ramsdale. So I did say earlier in the video that I'm going to have the contracts video coming out uh, this week there'll be more information on that in twi- on twitter and you can just check out luke penning at vgp also was um, asked and very much appreciated to be asked onto the ipswich fan zone uh, youtube channel um, ashley simmons and do an interview on there after the whole game um, and also massive thanks to ross media and the guys at the kings of anglia a podcast and magazine for allowing me to go on and, and share my thoughts um, after the game on their uh, channel as well you can also the main video of me is on us on their twitter account um so yeah stay tuned on um everything and if you like what you see um don't forget to subscribe um links down below in the description and i'll speak to you guys later on <laughs>